So Tom, we've just finished uh, the media day here, your uh, first session here, and here's what a feeling it must be to be a touring car driver. Yeah, it's incredible. Um, it's the first time, you know, I'm, I'm out there with all the other drivers. Um, there's lots to learn. Um, you know, I'm still not completely comfortable in my car. Um, it's only sort of my third or fourth day fully in my car and front wheel drive's taking a little bit of getting used to, but you know, I'm pleased, you know, with the setup we're running and uh, everything like that. I think I think the times are relatively representative and um, on old tires, you know, I'm close to my teammates. It's just maximizing a new tire grip takes a little bit of learning, but yeah, we'll get there. Now, obviously, you mentioned uh, the front wheel drive. You've spent your whole uh, career racing in rear wheel drives. This is going to be uh, quite a learning curve for you. Yeah, definitely. Um, there's, there's a lot of differences. Obviously, you know, there's a, there's a big difference between the Porsche and the Mercedes. Um, engine placement, obviously, front wheel drive to rear wheel drive. Um, you know, weight, aero, brakes. But um, but yeah, it's it's mainly the, the understanding what the rear does um, and having confidence that the rear is going to stick uh, when you go into a corner because obviously it's really light so it just takes a bit of getting used to and obviously uh, most of these boys have had a lot more experience they're a lot more confident on my car than I am so you know it, I just got to learn as best possible but you know I didn't spin didn't crash today uh, we had a small failure on me um, when a pipe burst but you know it wasn't my fault so yeah solid day. Well, not only is the uh, car different from Porsche's touring cars, but also the racing is very different. So that's going to be something that you're going to have to uh, adapt with the brands. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, I I'm used to starting in a mid-pack. Um, you know, I always love a good race. Um, I, this is this is going to be a, a world apart from that, you know. Um, there's going to be a bit more contact. There's going to be a bit closer racing. There's going to be difference of weight and all that sort of stuff. So there's a lot more to take in. But, you know, I... I it's a bit well that's the reason i joined touring cars you know that's, that's the aspect that i wanted to take advantage of um i think a lot of other people who've joined this year will have to get used to the same thing so yeah you know it's it's just something that you got to learn but you know i'm going to enjoy all my racing at brands Hatch and, and see where i come and uh, finally have you set yourself any targets yet or is it still too early uh the jack sears trophy is the obvious one um and a podium or two you know um I think at some points this year, you know, we'll be quick, the car will be quick, we'll have no weight in it, we'll have the right tyres on it and we'll have a chance to, to get it right at the front. Um, I've just got to wait for that opportunity really. I think overall consistency is the key and, and if I can come away fighting for the Jack Sears trophy and, uh, and, and getting a, you know, anywhere near the top 10 in the championship, I'll be ecstatic. Um, but just scoring regular points and, uh, you know, hopefully competing against my teammates, trying to beat them in a race or two and uh, yeah, we'll see where we go. Okay, thanks for your time, Tom. Very good luck for the season ahead. Thank you very much.